From Chris Six Sports, this is Friday Night Fever, sponsored by Thomas J. Henry. Hi, good evening, everybody. Welcome to the playoff edition of the Friday Night Fever. We're live at Buccaneer Stadium. It is quiet. It is empty now, but I promise you, we had a ball game tonight. In fact, Jay, roll the highlights. Let's show everybody what happened tonight. The big game between Veterans Memorial. Here they come at 9-1. and one. And across the way, Brownsville Veterans Memorial. They finished fourth in their district, coming in with a pretty good record themselves at 7-3. and three. Chargers turned it over three times tonight. Here's the first one. Jose Moreno is going to lose the pigskin picked up by there he is, Ryland Birch. And fourth and goal from inside the one. It's quarterback Aiden Hinojosa runs it in. 7 0 early in the second quarter. Big crowd on hand tonight. Again, we talked about those big turnovers by the Chargers. Here comes another one. It's going to get picked off by Luke Johnson. And look at Luke Ron down the sideline. He's going to run about 60 yards. He'll get inside the 20. There was blocking in the back. They brought it back 15 yards, but that's okay. It would lead to another Hinojosa run. It's another one-yard run, and this made it 14 to nothing. And then nine seconds before halftime, Corpus Christi Vet strikes again. It's Hinojosa connects with Cameron De La Pena, who just gets in. This made it 21 to nothing at halftime, and they would put it on cruise control down the stretch. Final score, Veterans Memorial wins it 28 to nothing. They advance on now. They're going to play Southwest ISD out of San Antonio next Friday night at the Alamo Dome at 730. Now, moments ago, I had a chance to talk with Coach Ben, ben Bittner, the head coach for Vets Memorial Corpus Christi. Now, this was actually his first game ever as head coach coaching a playoff game. He was very, very pleased with his team's performance tonight. Take a look. Roll it. I think our defense played really well. Coach Wilson and his staff, Coach Villarreal, Coach Gonzalez, Coach Harris, Coach White, they did a really good job with our defensive plan. Uh, put a lot of pressure on them. And then offensively, um, they made us grind it out. And our kids executed. Uh, and we're able to pick up first downs and move the sticks. And then, you know, we get up on them a couple scores, and it makes them really uncomfortable. I was really proud of our kids. All right, complete domination tonight by the Eagles on both the offensive and defensive side. So there you have it. That's the story as the Eagles win and win big, 28 to nothing. Advance on down to round two of the playoffs. And Patrick, we're off to a good start for our local team.